Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Daniel Radcliffe, during the production of the Harry Potter reunion special, revealed his crush on Helena Bonham Carter. The Harry Potter star made headlines with this revelation, and fans have been going crazy over it. Let's take a look at Daniel Radcliffe reveals secret crush on Harry Potter set. Number 5. Daniel Radcliffe revealed his childhood crush. Daniel Radcliffe revealed his on-set childhood crush was co-star Helena Bonham Carter in the highly anticipated HBO Max reunion special Harry Potter 20th Anniversary, Return to Hogwarts. Despite their 23-year age gap, Radcliffe admits in the upcoming anniversary show, Harry Potter 20th Reunion, Return to Hogwarts, that he handed his co-star a message declaring his love for her. Dear HBC, it was a delight being your co-star and coaster in the fact that I usually ended up upholding your coffee. The star wrote in a note to Bonham Carter, who portrayed Voldemort's underling after production completed in 2011. I adore you and I wish I had been born 10 years earlier so I could have had a chance. Number 4. Emma Watson's crush on Tom Felton However, Radcliffe wasn't the only one with an onset romance. Co-star Emma Watson, who played Hermione Granger, admitted to be smitten with Tom Felton, who portrayed Draco Malfoy. She explained, I walked into the area where we had instruction. The task was to depict what you felt God looked like, and Tom had sketched a female on a skateboard wearing a backward cap. And I don't know how else to put it, I'm in love with him. I used to come in every day and look for his name on the call sheet, which was number 7. And it was an extra exciting day if his name was on the call sheet, she continued. He was three years older than me, so he looked at me and said, you're like my little sister. Number 3. Tom Felton responds. Felton admits they have feelings for each other, but Watson stressed that it is now more of a brother-sister relationship. I grew quite protective of her, he explained. I've always had a warm spot in my heart for her, and I still do. Watson continues, with us, nothing has ever, ever, ever occurred romantically. We simply adore each other. That's all I have to say on the subject. Even co-star Rupert Grint saw the two's chemistry. In November 2019, the 33-year-old actor teased Entertainment Tonight. There was always something. There was a sliver of a spark. It was just like any other playground romance. There were no sparkles in my eyes. I didn't have any sparks. Number 2. Bonnie Wright speaks on developing crushes on set. In The Goblet of Fire, the actress who played Ginny Weasley explained, That film is all about teens developing affections for the first time asking somebody to be their date for the Yule Ball. The characters replicated all the awkward periods that you go through as a teenager, and they felt like that too because we were genuinely going through the same things. For his part, Daniel Radcliffe expressed gratitude for the opportunity to channel his awkward, geeky adolescent self as the series' eponymous character, referring to the Goblet of Fire as peak hormone for all the players involved. During the HBO special, he added, That picture, it was everything kicking off. He's simply a bit of an awkward teenage boy in a pretty commonplace way, which I suppose feels unusual for a hero character in a movie. Number 1. What to Expect in Return to Hogwarts The official trailer for Harry Potter's 20th anniversary Return to Hogwarts was recently revealed, and the whole show will air soon. The preview shows us what to anticipate from the reunion, and when it will be published, and who will be in there. When will Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Return to Hogwarts be released? And who will star alongside Daniel Radcliffe, Emma Watson, and Rupert Grint? On New Year's Day, 1st January 2022, HBO Max and Sky Max released Harry Potter's 20th Anniversary, Return to Hogwarts. Daniel Radcliffe, Rupert Grint, and Emma Watson are expected to join others. Helena Bonham Carter, Robbie Coltrane, Ralph Fiennes, Jason Isaacs, Gary Oldman, Tom Felton, James Phelps, Oliver Phelps, Mark Williams, Bonnie Wright, Alfred Enoch, Matthew Lewis, Ivana Lynch. The use of the cast members' real names, as well as the teaser, suggests that the special will follow a pattern similar to HBO's Friends reunion, with key cast members reuniting and sharing their memories. The call you've been longing for has arrived, HBO Max writes. HBO Max will premiere Harry Potter 20th Anniversary Return to Hogwarts on New Year's Day. Daniel Radcliffe, Rupert Grint, and Emma Watson, who have appeared in all eight Harry Potter films, will return to Hogwarts for the first time to commemorate the 20th anniversary of the franchise's debut film, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, which was released this year. 
Through all new in-depth interviews and cast talks, the historical special Harry Potter 20th Anniversary Return to Hogwarts will present a captivating making of story, inviting viewers on a wonderful first person trip through one of the most beloved film series of all time. The highly anticipated retrospective will premiere on HBO Max at midnight on New Year's Day, January 1st, and will be a highlight of the holiday season. It doesn't seem like a big deal for the cast to be working with each other for more than a decade to develop some personal feelings towards each other. Most of the cast grew up together on set, so having romantic interactions doesn't seem too crazy. Well, this brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit like if you did. We will see you soon in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.